There are 13 root servers worldwide. They all contain the same information, so it does not matter which one is used. The historical location of root servers would be another example. Um, ten of them are located in the United States, and their original location first reflects the development of the Internet in the United States, and also that one of the characteristics of a root name server is that you would like it to be as close to as many people on the network as possible, so that the response times um, from you to that root server are as quick as possible. The stability of the root server has up till now worked fairly well, but it is uh, a little bit uh, vulnerable if, for any reason, all states decided, or some groups of states or groups of, of users decided not to follow that root server system. So the system is at this point working, but the potential is there for destabilization. It's preferable that these routes be run with the agreement of the most important and the most relevant parties affected and respecting the needs of the users of the internet. So there you have the need for a governance, not a government, but a governance agreement.